Hey everybody, this is Robot here from Best Motorsport here in San Diego, ScooterWest.com. What do we got here? Oh, it's a BB350. Uh, it's the scooter that I mostly ride actually. Uh, it's got a problem. Motor's out. Um, so what happened with this scooter is a 2013 model. The customer has never changed the coolant on it. And that one of the coolant passages has rusted through because the coolant is broken down and it caused what you call a milkshake. And I mean, a lot of times with cars, whatever, automobiles, whenever you get the oil mixing with um, the coolant or transmission fluid mixing with the coolant, for instance, on a car, if you have the transmission cooler uh, leaking, you end up with this lovely stuff. And I'm not gonna eat this, but it looks like kind of like a vanilla milkshake right here. And it's, I'm gonna show you what the problem is right here. So we tore this motor down and you can see this freeze plug right here is rusted all the way through. And what happens is the prior coolant in the, the system has um, broken down, you know, the rust inhibitor uh, properties of the coolant. It doesn't really affect the aluminum head, but unfortunately there's other parts of the, uh, the engine system that are made of steel and it rusted all the way through that that um, freeze plug that's in the cylinder head. Uh, so unfortunately we're gonna have to put this motor back together either with a new cylinder head or replace that freeze plug which isn't really available as a spare part. Um, the motor wasn't run too long with this um, kind of cocktail of coolant and oil but that's something that can happen if you don't take care of the coolant system. And not to pick on Piaggio products, but I'll tell you the coolant comes in the bikes uh, from when they're new is not the greatest stuff. Uh, I don't know if it's diluted much, but after about five years, um, the rust inhibitor factors of the coolant don't seem to work so good. So that's why in some of the videos where I've uh, illustrated on how to do a coolant flush, recommend doing it every two years, and that's what Vespa and Piaggio recommend as well. And you put, you know, a higher quality uh, ethyl glycol coolant in there, 50-50 mix, you're gonna get a much longer service out of the engine without the coolant system rusting out. Until next time, just showing kind of some typical disasters that we run into at the shop, and showing what the, um, the problem is here. Uh, just a nice short video. See everybody next time.